from the culture of the American South, where roots hold stories, comes a natural deodorant inspired by generations of wisdom. Introducing Root Work, the all-natural foundational Black American-based deodorant infused with the magic of High John the Conqueror root. Our unique blend enriched with this legendary root offers 24-hour protection rooted in the power of nature. Embrace this deodorant that celebrates culture, history, and your well-being. Unlock the magic of root work today. Experience the pure essence of nature. Visit rootworkstyle.com and make the switch to a healthier cultural choice. Beautiful. Let's get some sisters in here. I see Tiffany down here. Miss Tiffany, here. Let's get some sisters in the mix. All right. All right, Miss um, Tiffany, how are you, dear? Uh, hello? Yes, ma'am. How are you doing? I'm good, Tiffany. Everything all right, dear? No, absolutely not. What's wrong? Uh, what's the topic? Oh, no, we're just talking about random stuff, ma'am. Is everything, what's wrong? What's, what's happening? Listen, so um, I got a petition out. So if anybody want to go up there and sign in, check it out and be stopped like me, feel free to sign it. It's on change.org forward slash. What's the petition? What's the petition for, ma'am? Oh, um, yeah, my civil rights. Um, it's civil war out here. You guys might think it's a movie coming out in April, but it's happening right now. So, um, that that just dropped. Civil war just dropped just now. You guys don't gotta wait until April. We lie. Um, Tiffany, where's your family from, dear? Um, Louisiana. Okay. Um, what kind of mental health disorder do you have, dear? <laughs> mental health disorder. Yeah. What? I'm looking at your page, and there's something about stopping police brutality on those with mental health disorders. So. Yeah, I'm, I'm assuming that you are a person who might possibly have a mental health disorder, which is okay. That's not a judgment, ma'am. What's what's going on with your mental health, I mean, or what's yeah, what's? Yeah, you know, I've battled with like anxiety and stuff like that. What what else have you been diagnosed with, ma'am? Um, just some other stuff, but I'm not really gonna. But get like into what? This. No, we're not here to judge. I just because you know there's something going on, and I'm I'm, I'm being well. Sensitive. What 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 have you what have you been diagnosed with, dear? I've I'm been, not trying to. I've been diagnosed with a couple things, but like what? Like what? Um, bipolar, anxiety, PTSD. Um, I can't think of everything. Okay. <clears throat> okay, it's okay. It's okay. We're not. We're not trying to beat up on you, sis. So you normally I would clown folks, but no, 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 no. No, I, I get it. I get it. You, you got some stuff going on, and you know sometimes you get frustrated and you want to get some stuff off your chest. I get it. No, this is serious. I, so, I know. Listen, my cousin. He passed away. He got shot by the police okay. in California, but he has schizophrenia. Okay, but that does that yeah. kind of some things like that run in your family, dear? Yeah, it does. Yeah, but okay. he was not armed; he was unarmed. So yeah. the moral of this is: check out my change petition. is very vital. Got it. Got it. okay, sister. Well, I'm I'm gonna check it out seriously. But thank you. No, for- and sign it. Sign that motherfucker. Okay, let's calm down. All right, let's get your medicine, dear. All right, let's calm down. <laughs> no, all no, right. no, I don't need no medicine. All right, sister, calm down. It's all right. I'm, I'm with you. To... Um, sister, I'm with you. All right, sister, calm down. Let's get you, let's drink you some milk. And <sighs> take your medicine and get you go to bed. Okay, it's just past your bedtime. 
Where do you stay? Do you stay in a group home, ma'am? Where do you stay? No, I don't stay in a group home. Ma'am, oh, ma'am, who's your caretaker? Who who takes <laughs> What? Ma'am. What? Who, Actually, who... I do uh, honestly, what's your name? Ma'am, who's your caretaker? Ma'am. Ma Sir, ma what is your name? Ma'am, ma'am. Sir, Who I'm actually, I'm looking for one because my hand is fucked up. If you read my petition, you can see my hand is messed up. Okay. I'm, I need someone for my, my left hand. I can not hold nothing. I can barely open anything. My hand is messed up. I had third degree frostbite. Ma'am, ma who's your so, care? Right, Ma'am, are you still staying with your parents, or do you, they have you with caretakers right now? They have. Yeah, I have a caretaker. I have someone taking care of me while my going through this. My hand is fucked up. Got it. Got it. Well, your caretaker should. You should have a bedtime. It's very late right now. How come the your caretaker? Wait, hold up! Hold up! Hold up! How old do you think I am? It doesn't matter how old you are, dear. You you know you you're not in a position to kind of take care of yourself. And I would assume that you would have a caretaker that would kind of say, okay, lights out, time to go to bed. Okay, you know what this remind me of? What, ma'am? That one song where he's where he's like riding around. He's like, nigga, is you okay? Is you okay, nigga? When he's trying to give the patient the meds. It's not that type of party, sir. So anyway, listen. He's been hit by a street general, okay? Yeah. It's, it's not... It's not it's not like that. You're just, it's okay. just blown this way out of proportion. I'm not, beloved. It's going to be okay. I just don't want you to get upset and, you know. Oh, my goodness. Not beloved. Damn. This is not like, this is not Oprah. This is not any of that. Okay. Is, I know what you're, where you're going with this, but this is not beloved. No, I just want you to be okay, ma'am. That's all. Oh, Are my we goodness. Good? Are you okay? Everything all right? I just want you. To, I don't want you to okay, be frustrated. Okay, All right, listen, Tariq. I'm fine. My blood, good. everything is good. My good. hand is fucked up. It's my. I don't want actually, you to, it's not I, good. Everything. I don't is want not you to good. get riled up and you go outside and kick a dog or something. I, I want you to oh, be my okay. Goodness, Tariq, uh, what is going? On? What is it like? Where are you at? I'm. I'm home, ma'am. I'm home. I'm home. Where's your caretaker? What city state you in? She's upstairs. My, that's my wife. She's my caretaker. <laughs> that's my lady. You need to go upstairs. What, where is, I, what state you in? I'm in California, ma'am. I'm in California. Oh, California? With the police? Mm -hmm. Me and my G's. Wow! So anyway, yes, Tyree, what? make sure you... Let's get that medicine, decision. okay, dear? Let's really get oh. that medicine. Okay? <laughs> Let's take your pills. Oh, my. I gotta go. All I right, gotta dear. go. All right. All right. You, you be safe, beloved. You guys sign my petition. It's okay. out there. <sighs> Bless our heart. Bless our heart, man. Unfortunately, man, being in this system, it has a lot of us crazy as cat shit out of here, man. It's so unfortunate. And, and, you know, and I'm taking my time with the folks because we do have a lot of brothers and sisters out here who have mental illnesses and mental issues and um, these white supremacists look at them as easy targets, which is, I get where this is just coming from. I get it. I get it. And I want us to be in a position to be able to better take care of our brothers and sisters who are sitting ducks for these white supremacists. You understand? Because a lot of um, our folks who do actually have um, mental issues, psychological issues, they, they're not giving any leeway. Um, there's a case down in Florida where there's um, a special needs kid. Um, they triggered him. The, 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 he went to school and they triggered him. And then he beat down on uh, one of the female teachers and they're trying to throw the book at this kid, man. And that's not cool. That's not cool. These low life demonic white supremacists um, trying to put cases on people who clearly don't have the mental capacity to understand what's going on um, for a situation where they didn't kill nobody. But the minute a white boy shoot up a school, if he had one antidepressant pill 15 years ago, they'll throw the damn case out. You see what I'm saying? They always do this. These white boys shoot up schools all the time and they find any type of um, behavioral Write up they've ever had and use that as an excuse to to go light on them, you know. 
So yeah, I ain't with that. So, you know, I am very sensitive to our um, brothers and sisters like that. The sister who called up, I am sympathetic to her because it sounded like she had some real stuff going on. Now, we've had some folks call up here talking crazy, but it, it was clearly crack. You know, you can tell when it's crack crazy. Crack crazy and having some psychological issues, that's different. You know, we, we've had some people call up and it's like, clearly the crack is talking. So you can tell what's what. Um, huh. Let's get... Um, we got a lot of people. Um, Donica, get Donica in here. Then we'll get Forgotten Latino History in here. Miss Donica? Sir Tariq. Hey, Miss Donica, how are I'm you? I'm great. How are you, sir? I am very good. Donica, what's on your mind, dear? Um, honestly, you're not wrong. The crack is cooking. And the sniffing mm. of the Adderall is hitting, per se. Uh oh. You know, people are going crazy in our streets. And uh, we just want them to do better. You know what I mean? Like, they're, this is weak. It's uh, obsolete, in fact. And I think that you have the right message, and so do I. We just want the best for our community. Whoever's giving me a thumbs mm -hmm. down, if you got the chest to come talk to me with, do that. But don't give a thumbs down. Thank you. All right. Thank you, Donica. All right. Now, that was the crack talking. Um, forgotten Latino history. Hop on, brother. Um, forgotten Latino history. Hop on. Hello? Yes, sir. Hey, how are you? I'm a huge What's going fan. on? How you doing, brother? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Um, I've been following you for a long time. Uh, one of the things I have in common with you is I'm an independent researcher. Yes. Um, and I, I wanted to ask you uh, if you were aware that there's a, a, almost a conspiracy to rewrite history today, to rewrite oh, American yeah. history, oh, to, yeah. re to rewrite black American history. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yes, yes. I, I, uh, I'm familiar with your project with the, the microphone check project. Yes. But, you know, but it's much bigger than that. It, is, it all relates to Latinos. It all relates to Latinos, yeah? Yeah, and I've seen some of your posts, man. You go in on them lies. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And Let uh, folks know a, who, your, who your profile picture is. Is one of the... the oh, yeah. The, the, my, pro, my profile picture is a man named Felix T. Harino. Uh, yeah. He's, a, he's a, a Texan. From, he was a president of LULAC, uh, who was also a white supremacist. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, who supported segregation, you know, and, and uh, hated niggers and just was just very, very mean. But he's being celebrated as a hero today, right. along with many other Latinos uh, in American history. Right. They are they're trying to sit here and tie themselves into the civil rights movement now. Yes. Oh, oh yes. Yes. It, 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 I think it's much worse than most people imagine. You know, uh, the debate over the origins of hip hop. Um, that's the least of it. That's the least. They're trying to insert themselves into civil rights history, claiming, you know, that they did all these things and made all these contributions uh, that they did not and that they wanted nothing to do with back then. Uh, uh, you know, since today, you know, we're talking about Black History Month. Uh, we should think about preserving history, preserving, the, you know, the truth of history. I think so. Because, yes, you know, indeed. I call this Latinx revisionism, this new wave of revisionism that started about 15 years ago. And they're trying to rewrite black American history. You know, yes, they're trying they to say, you know, that Mexicans, they were, they were drinking from colored water fountains. They had to sit on the back of the bus, you know, and they were fighting for civil rights with black people and all kinds of just, well, that's not true. That's just right. Not true. And it gets worse and worse. Right. They, 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 Are you familiar with the Mendez versus West, West, Westminster story? Yeah, that was the, was that the school out in like San Diego somewhere? In Orange or County, California. Orange, California. Orange, okay, Nothing yeah, yeah, yeah. Where they, yeah, they, they like to Nothing. cite that case. They love Nothing. citing that case um, where basically they were fighting to be labeled white so they can go to school with white kids. Yes, and what they're doing is making false historical claims about Mendez and using it uh, 
to make political claims, to get funding, to get awards, and to rewrite history, to rewrite history. So, you know, it, it wasn't black people, it, you know, it was Latinos. They were the pioneers of civil rights and stuff. Right, right. Because and, and this they, is not, and this is not like fringe opinions. This is a mainstream, uh, mainstream thing. The most respected, award-winning uh, historians are saying all of this garbage. Yeah, because I've seen them say, well, that that Mendez case was before Dr. King and all of this stuff, but it wasn't. Well, they say Mendez was first. They say Mendez was first. Yeah, but that wasn't you know, about black people, rights. You know, they, they owe everything to you know to Mendez, and Mendez started it all on things like this. I mean, that's just one of the claims that people are making. They're saying the Mexicans freed the slaves, horse crap. Helped them escape, you know, and, and, and you know, helped them escape on an underground railroad to Mexico. All kinds of craziness, and none of these stories are true. None yeah. of these stories are true. And this kind of revisionism, it's a kind of aggression against black people that's happening today. It's a kind of aggression. Yes, indeed. So, you know, I think, you know, for Black History Month, we need to think about preserving the truth. The truth. Yes, indeed. And just being conscious that this is happening. I've been researching this for like... Oh, shit. Sure. I thought you were done, but I took you off. But, but thank you so much. I landed the plane. Very good points. Very, very good points, man. They are definitely trying to rewrite history. And it's up to us to stand on business and say, no, this is what really happened. We have to change the narrative, man. Miss Trinity, hop on, dear. Trinity. Hey, I'm here. Can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. How are you, dear? Peace, peace, peace and love. Much love to everyone. I'm cold. Um, I'm great. Hope everyone is doing well. I just wanted to speak on these um, deceitful life supremacists for a minute. That space that you invited yeah. the family to the other day where the co-host chick was saying how much she didn't like black men and what have you. I just want to warn her fellow life supremacist uh, counterparts that she's likely the reason their birth rates are so low because Women like her, I believe, are begging for black genitalia, okay? <laughs> and um, black men need to resist more, and I think that their rates are so low, um, not only because FBA women aren't checking for them, of course, but their own women are not checking for them. You know, maybe if they decided to once, once and for all uh, replace this wicked system, you know, that we're under, uh, perhaps their women would come around more. I mean, we know that their women are just as wicked, but, you know, it's just a theory. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's heavy. It's real heavy, man. But thank you so much. Thank you, dear. All right. Man, man, man. All right. We'll get a couple of more folks in here because there are a lot of people in here. All right, let's get um, Mr. Abdullah, Abdullah Mirza. Mr. Abdullah. Mr. Abdullah, let's get you on, sir. And um, let's try Abdullah, then we'll try Adam. Mr. Adam, hop on, Adam. Uh, Adam. Hey, what's up? What's going on, Adam? How are you? Hey, I want to know, like, why blacks complain so much. Complain about what? What do we complain You're about? You're complaining about, like, white people and shit. Like, you don't hear Mexicans complaining, fool. Like, why you complain so much? I mean... We don't see y'all complain? Are you serious? Hey, homie, you see us doing fucking construction? We take care of our kids? We don't be complaining like you motherfuckers. And you sound like you're trying to pretend to be Mexican. You sound like you're trying to be white, talking all proper, fool. Yeah, you're doing a Mexican accent. You're really a, an Irish white man. Yeah, and you're really a you? fucking gay black guy, homie. Sir, is your trailer park gassed up right now. Is your fucking project building have fucking roaches in it, homie? 
Well, the project buildings have a lot of you poor white trash supremacists in there, sir. So I hey, can't homie, get in there. You talking about poor? I have, to, I, I have to pay rent, sir. And I don't get Section 8 like you white supremacists. Hey, homie, so what's we my, make more money than you motherfuckers, fool. Okay, you're just yelling profanities over and over. So we see you have a limited vocabulary. So you must be some kind of Middle Eastern. Last time I Where checked, from? Last time I checked the. L last time you checked, you shut that mouth. Where are you from? Yeah, your material is kind of dry. Where you, Where are you from, sir? So you blacks have the lowest income pool. Okay, and you have the lowest birth rate. So how's that working? How's those birth rates working out for you, buddy? Hmm? Mr. Adam? Come on, Mr. Hey, old homie, you don't even take care of your fucking kids. You abandon your kids, well, who? Well, your low birth rates are you're abandoning your sperm cells, sir. You got those low birth rates. What are you going to do about that? Hmm? Hey, homie, you're a bitch, fool. You're a fucking bitch. Come but the only bitch is your grandma who has to lick balls for cotton candy money, nigga. All right. These balls are a carnival to your grandma. And that's the bitch. All right. So what's on your mind? Come on now. Let's get real. You're getting very angry. Am I frustrated? Is Black Daddy getting you frustrated, sir? I just want you to stop fucking complaining. I'm tired of Blacks it's always begging for money, fool. Complaining. Just build your fucking community, fool. Well, sir, you're the one who fled from yours. How can you tell me to build mine and you fled? How does that work? Hey, homie, California used to be Mexico. You fled Africa, fool. Um, sir, and, and, sir, and and the Mexicans got paid for selling California, sir. So you, if you tricked off the money and smoked it up, whose fault is that? Hey, the blacks got paid. Hey, nothing. Hey, nothing. Mexico got paid $15 million. Yeah, and you didn't get paid, fool. You were working and, for free. And, 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 You're and, a sir, bum, fool. You worked for and, free, fool. And, Sir, you smoked the money up, we, and you're mad at us because you smoked up the money like a crackhead. What did y'all do with that $15 million, which is the equivalent of half a million dollars today? That's why we freed the slaves. Only the Mexicans freed the slaves. Sir, you didn't free anybody. What slaves did you free, sir? Who did you free? We Come on, you can't even get your lie out. Who did you free? You fleed the slave. You fled from your homeland. You didn't free, you flee, sir. Go ahead, sir. I, hey, I they're, so, they're so poor in the ghetto, fool. We don't live in the ghetto, homie. It's only black, fool. Um, sir, if you don't stop it, sir, please stop it. Stop I've never seen a nice black neighbor, fool. It's all fucking ghetto, fool. Stop the projection, sir. Yeah, you're not really selling the gangster cholo thing. It, it's it's not selling like it's supposed to. Yeah, sir. they're not fucking selling any movies. You put out low budget films, homie. Low right. budget. Fool. The only low budget film I put out was a porno film with your grandmother. All right, it was called Hose in the Hood, and we only made a couple of dollars off of it. So you're right. That was a very low budget movie because I had a low budget hole like your grandma in it. So what else is going on, sir? Go ahead, sir. Go ahead, Adam. I don't have you blocked, sir. I think you dropped a burrito on your phone. Go ahead, Adam. You keep muting me, fool. Uh, sir, if you're dropping an empanada on the phone, that's not my fault, sir. Just watch what you're doing, okay? What's going on with you? What's on your mind? Hey, what's up with your rap career, fool? You used to be a fucking rapper. You didn't make it, fool. You failed, fool. No, 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 no. I wrap my lips around your grandmother's tits. So I'm very successful at that. And guess what she wraps her mouth around? All right. You can only imagine, right? So we're both rappers. <laughs> me and your grandmother, me and Rosalita. I wrap my mouth around them spicy tits. And she wraps her lips around chocolate dick. So black and brown does get down hey really. and it's why your black that's, women don't want you fool they're divesting the fool the why your black women divesting on me trying they're to get a mexican black. dick fool you got they're small not. dicks fool the, the, the black women are not trying to lay up in a docker camp they're not trying to lay up with you sir so stop fantasizing you wish all right you know me all the black girls say can you teach me spanish i love mexicans 
They don't want you, motherfuckers. Uh, yes, indeed. Yeah, they're trying to get with you so they can buy a kilo of cocaine so they can flip it. So they're hustling you for your drugs, sir. That don't count. You're getting, you're the plug. So that's why they're hollering at you. They're trying to get the. the, the hey, real talk to me. Who you see doing construction, fool? All they see is Mexicans, homie. But how come you're not constructing your homeland? How come you're living in shacks? Uh, hey, homie, why don't you go to Africa? That's but your no, homeland. I, I know it's not. My, my homeland is here. I'm a foundational black American, sir. This is my homeland here. And I never you fought. your homeland, homie? Why didn't you yes, build anything, fool? We did. We built this whole nation. That's why I never had to get a here. job from a black person, fool. That's, that's, that's why you were able to flee here, sir. So you're welcome. You got to give us thanks, sir. You're welcome. Hey. Go ahead, sir. Oh, are you okay? I don't have you muted, sir. Go ahead. Go ahead. You're running out of material, sir. Come on. Just like you. Hey, what, hey hold me. What, what companies you built, fool? If you sir? built this country, I don't see no black companies, fool. This is the white man's companies, fool. What's what's your company, sir? What what company do you have over here? Hey, hold me. You know, there's Mexican restaurants everywhere, fool. Yeah, I love Taco Bell. I had a, a chicken burrito earlier, so yes. Hey, but Mexicans build more than blacks, fool. We build a what, lot more than you. What? What? Like what? Name a name a corporation hey. that you name your corporations that you run, sir. Go ahead. Hey, Omi. We built the railroads in the West Coast, fool. Okay. Um, what railroads? Go look at uh, Mexican railroad workers, fool. Okay, you're trying to Google something and it's giving you some wrong information. All right, you didn't build nothing. You didn't build railroads in Mexico. So what are you talking? You about? didn't even build your fucking uh, Baltimore, homie. Look at Baltimore. Look at Detroit, fool. You live in fucking slums, homie. Um, it's better than your homeland, sir. Right? Mexicans don't live and, like that, and, fool. And you're, and you're fleeing to those very cities from your homeland. Those are the very cities you're fleeing to. So that shows how dilapidated your homeland is, sir, right? Right? Hey, you homie, I never had to get a job. You, you I never named, had to get a job from a black named, person, fool. You just named cities that you are fleeing to now, sir. I, hey, I never had to get a job from a black motherfucker, homie. I don't give sir, a fuck. Sir, sir, you didn't build shit, fool. You didn't build nothing, fool. You, yes, you wouldn't be able to flee if it weren't for us having a country to you for you to flee to, sir. You didn't build shit, fool. Yes, we did. We you didn't even build Africa, homie. We don't. We're, I'm not African, so I'm a foundational Black American. The place you fled You're to. You're African, fool. You look like I'm an a, African. I'm a, I'm a foundational Black American, sir. Hey, and, homie. And you're a wannabe Anglo. You're not even Anglo. You're a wannabe. You can't even go to we Europe. We got European but, blood, fool. Uh, Mexicans got European and, blood, homie. And, and can't go to Europe for nothing. They won't accept you in Europe, sir. And that's why you're mad. Is that why you're upset? You can't be accepted in Europe. You can't be accepted in your homeland. So you had to come to eat all foundational black Americans. And that makes you... Hey, you, got, you got sold from the African that. chiefs, homie. They sold your bitch ass out, fool, in Africa, homie. And you got sold by Border Patrol, okay? They sold you over here, made, your, made you give a blowjob in order to get over the fence. So ain't that horrible? You fled Africa, fool. And you fled your homeland, sir. I didn't flee anything. This is my homeland. Been here for centuries, sir. Why don't you build shit, fool? I do. We built everything here, sir. We built the whole I thing. I don't see anything that's owned by blacks, fool. Um, nothing, shit, fool. Uh, well, we don't... You, you fled your homeland, and you don't have anything there, sir. You over here eating off us, sir. The DACA program. Hey, hey Mexico's DACA. richer than African da countries, uh, fool. DACA? Uh, I'm not... Uh, that's fine. I'm not from Africa. Um, the, the, we you built the DACA up program. The we poorest built DACA. countries, fool. They're we, African we built, countries. I mean, you can even no, build but, Africa, fool. No, but I, I, I'm not from Africa, sir. Uh, I'm a foundational black American, sir. You can talk about Africa all day. It has nothing to do with me. I, I, I built where you fled to, sir. And we built DACA, and you're eating off that. That's built for us. That's us. Hey, only you can even build your communities, fool. Um, sir, we have, sir. And we don't flee from you, them. We like fucking kill each other in the ghettos, fool. Okay, Mr. El Chapo and uh, drug lord land, sir, you're talking about killing and you come from a culture of drug lords and... Hey, homie, I looked at the fucking stats. We don't kill each other like you, homie. Yes, you do, sir. You can, that's Not in America, fool. 
Well, that's why you have to flee, sir. You kill yourself to the point where you have to flee. Is that making you upset? Are you upset with black daddy because white daddy made you have to flee and you're mad at us? We're the only people helping you, sir. Hey, Omi, why don't you, you black spike one on one, Omi? And you and you mad at black daddy? Why are you mad at black daddy? You mad at black hey, daddy? You fucking gay, Omi. You're fucking uh, gay, fool. Oh, dude, you're the one who's upset and bussified laying on his stomach right now, rubbing a burrito between his cheeks. That's you, sir. You're very upset and emotional right now. That's not me. Flee. Reparations, fool. Where's your reparations, Omi? Flee. Um, um, women from your community. That's a form of. You can't even. That's reparation. They don't even Bang. respect you, fool. They won't even give you reparations, fool. Banging, banging your women is reparations. How about that? That's a nice little payment, right? Hey, homie, you don't get no bitches, fool. You get yes, all the you... fat bitches, fool. No, 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 no. That would be your... your you see a your... black guy with a Mexican? She's fat, fool. No, like you. You talk. And a you... white girl, fat white girl, fool. Stop it. You sound very husky and little, sir. You look like Super Mario. Go jump over some barrels and get your little ass on somewhere, sir. Okay. Anyway, thank you so much. Yeah, you. Hey, you're a... fucking mayate, fool. Fuck you, homie. Okay. Sir, you sound like you're in a wheelchair, so I'm trying to sound tough. You're not tough. You sound very little, um, very pudgy. Yeah, well, people's very dough boy. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right. Boy, they're very upset with foundation of black Americans and not the white supremacists that decimated your homeland and destroyed your economy. There's your black and brown right there.